powering the Raspberry Pi directly off DC power in the off-grid shed. Let's get started. All right guys, welcome back to the channel. So in the last video, I've gone ahead and hooked up a Raspberry Pi along with Solar Assistant. This is for monitoring the off-grid shed as well as controlling the inverter. Now I've gone ahead and hooked up this Raspberry Pi. I'm powering it directly off DC power. So I'm pretty excited about this. It's a big improvement to what I was using before. I want to show you some of the connections. Now to power up the Raspberry Pi, I'm using this little buck converter. Its uh, input range is from eight to 35 volts. This is being used to convert the voltage down to five volts for the Raspberry Pi. All right guys, so I want to show you the wires and how it's hooked up to the uh, entire system. So there's a positive and negative that comes off the buck converter and I'm running each side into the positive bus bar and negative bus bar. They're just running behind each of the end lines right here for the battery hookups. If I go off to the side, you may be able to see the cable behind there. You can see it a little bit better on the DC side. So able to hide the uh, power cables for the buck converter there. Also coming out of the, uh, the positive line, which hooks into here, I, I do have a small inline fuse just to protect that wire and the uh, components. I do take some pride in the design and the workmanship here. Uh, I tried to hide all my wires and make everything look nice and tidy and professional. So from there, there's also a USB line that comes out. It's USB-C, it runs into this power switch here, then it goes up to power the Raspberry Pi. From the Raspberry Pi, USB out, I'm running up through the main positive line and into the uh, MPP solar inverter. I've gone ahead and ordered an 18 inch USB cable, uh, which will replace this. I don't need all this, this is like a three foot cord. Not quite sure what I'm gonna do with the Raspberry Pi, if I'm gonna mount it on the wall board, or if I'm gonna keep it loose like this. I may go ahead and design a 3D box for it. Right now, I do like it where it's at, right in the center of the system. I can access it, I can pull it out if I need to service it and so forth. All right guys, so that's how I'm powering up the Raspberry Pi now, DC direct through that buck converter and uh, it makes for a much more efficient system and I'm pretty pleased with the results. All right guys, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Come on back for more videos, DIY off-grid, solar shed, along with a bunch of other DIY videos. Thanks for watching, take care, have a great day.